Hello everybody, my name is Jafar Tungekar and I am responsible for D-Link Rack business in India. Communication between your business and your client is vital and it significantly depends on your network infrastructure. Your network infrastructure is the backbone of your day-to-day -day operations. Everything else in your business relies on that backbone being strong and reliable so they can operate successfully. Thus, racks are one of the integral parts of your network infrastructure. D-Link is a pioneer in end-to-end -end network solutions. While you all are well-versed and connected with D-Link active and passive range of products that help you establish a strong infrastructure. However, a strong network needs a strong backbone too. Therefore, D-Link racks or enclosures is a right fit for your network storage and security requirements. In the modern day evolution of rack technology, advancement from the basics towards the data center and smart rack solutions. Let me take this opportunity to give you an overview of what we have in dealing rack portfolio. When you are designing a data center, server room or network closet, deciding which racks to deploy and how to configure them should be at the top of your list. Just like building a house, the surface details may steal the spotlight, but it's the quality of the underlying foundation that makes the difference between success and frustration. Racks organize IT equipment such as servers and network switches into standardized assemblies that make efficient use of space and other resources. Depending on the options you choose, they can also improve power protection, cooling, cable management, device management, physical securities, mobility, ease of installation and protection from harsh environmental conditions. Choosing the right racks and configuring them to match your needs will ensure that your IT equipment operates reliably and efficiently, saving your organization from costly downtime and other needless expenses. Basically, it all starts with networking and server racks. What you see on the extreme left of your screen is the wall mount racks that includes indoor as well as the outdoor racks. What you see at the center of the slide is flow standing closed four post and open two post racks with high density vertical cable organizers. And at the extreme right side of your screen is dealing server racks. This is how exactly our welded frame range of racks would look when you unbox it. However, we also have the entire range in the CKD format. CKD is nothing but the modular design wherein the racks are supplied in completely knockdown packing. CKD is useful for storage as well as logistics convenience. We also have flow standing rack complete range in extruded aluminum frame design that is bolted design but supplied in ready to use erected format. By the way, once these CKD racks are assembled, it looks identical to the welded frame rack. Dealing two post racks is a great space saving solution. When you have a space constraint in your facility or else when you do not have huge rack space, especially the front and rear door opening space for your rack rows, this is mostly when you have a lot of patch panels and switches coming into a single rack with no servers, of course. Moving forward, what you see on the left of your screen is dealing outdoor IP55 racks and on the right side of your screen is double section racks. Let us have a look at dealing outdoor racks on the actual environment where it is installed on the field. This is all dealing pole mount racks installed at various customer sites. However, it can also be supplied as wall mount or base mount outdoor racks based on the actual requirement case to case. Now let us move from the basics to the advanced solutions that can be supplied with features like biometric locks. In the third party data centers, you would see a lot of cages installed around the racks as it is a shared premises with multiple customers at same place, same flow. Now what you see on your screen is all kind of biometric solutions that can either be authenticated with MyFairCard, Access 
or a fingerprint access or card plus pin access control with manual override or card plus pin access control with manual override with LCD screen or card plus pin plus biometric access control with manual override plus fingerprint etc. Based on your requirements, various options can be provided. Many a times what happens is that just for a single rack requirement, you have to create and maintain the entire facility as air conditioned environment, wherein the requirement is only for the rack. You actually end up maintaining the entire facility with air conditioning unit, which is actually a big expense and not worth. Rack with air conditioning unit inside the rack will generate the cold air inside the rack itself and throw it from the front and since your servers dissipate heat from the rear, the same heat would be sucked into the AC compressor unit and it will be again converted to the cold air and again thrown back from the front. So it is a self-sufficient rack that does not need anything from the outside except for the power and internet. Here it does not matter what is the temperature outside the server rack. Whatever may be the outside temperature, inside temperature would depend on the air conditioning unit that you have installed and the heat dissipated by your servers inside the rack. In a row of multiple racks or multiple row of racks, a containment system can be used to isolate hot aisles and cold aisles from each other and prevent hot air and cold air from mixing. Containment system started out as physical barriers that simply separated the hot and cold aisle as illustrated in the picture. Along with the biometric and the air conditioning unit, we can also give you other features like temperature and humidity sensors. These sensors would give you an idea of what is the exact temperature inside your rack. And with this, you ensure that there is no downtime due to temperature inside the rack. What you see in this picture is the actual picture of dealing smart rack. On the left side of your screen is the front view of the smart rack. And on the right side is the rear view of the same rack. There is also an LCD installed on the front door. This LCD gives you the overview of the features to set temperatures and humidity thresholds in your rack. For example, if you want your server racks to have a temperature between 20 to 24 degree all the time, you can set a threshold of 20 to 24 degree and whenever your temperature goes less than 20 degree or more than 24 degree, the white text will convert itself into the red text so that your IT manager or a technician sitting outside would know that there is a problem and he can immediately take appropriate measures. This way, you exactly know what is going on inside your rack at a remote location. Along with this, you can add many more features like door open sensors, smoke detectors, fire suppressions, intelligent PDUs and so on. Let us move to the center picture where you can see a camera installed inside the rack. This will help you know how many times the door is opened and who opened the door. Camera would also take a picture every time the door is open. It will also keep track of how many times the door was open with authentic and how many times it was open with unauthentic access. Authentic is when it is open using the biometric control and unauthentic is when it is open using the manual keys. So with this, you can also restrict the access of the rack by an unauthorized person trying to open the rack unnecessarily when it is not required. Every time the door is open using your biometric or your manual override, it will take a picture and generate a log of all these transactions. Log will be maintained. So the conclusion is that smart rack system is an intelligent solution designed for data centers or remote locations or any type of IT applications where remote monitoring of your IT infrastructure is required. It is also a very user-friendly and cost-effective solution 
compared to a full fledged remote site where you need to maintain entire facility including room temperature as well as security features with an aware on site IT professional to update the head office or knock on a regular basis. Now let me share some market analysis and insight with you. Global data center transformation market is expected to reach US dollar 16 billion by 2025 from US dollar 6 billion a couple of years ago. Growing at a CAGR that is compound annual growth rate of 13.2% during the forecast period to 2025. The data center racks market was valued at USD 4 billion in 2019 and it is expected to reach a value of US dollar 6.8 billion by 2025 at a compound annual growth rate of 7.9% during the forecast period that is 2020 to 2025. Data centers have witnessed growth owing to the increasing dependence and spendings on cloud technologies recently. The data centers is essential for hosting mission critical application. These data centers help organizations streamline information while enabling easy access to users and customers from anywhere across the world. The growing deployment of data centers around the world is the major driving factor influencing the consumption of data center racks. The increasing demand for technology, services and increasing investments from major companies are also influencing the growth of the market. With changing technologies and adoption of high density servers, rack infrastructure has become an important aspect in data centers. With the need to effectively host servers, manage cables and facilitate airflow for ensuring the optimum performance of data centers. A data center rack is a type of physical steel and electronic framework that is designed to house servers, networking devices, cables and other data center computing equipments. Data center racks are deployed primarily for infrastructure management in data centers. These are being used in the manufacturing, retail, BFSI, IT and telecom industry. So friends, that's it for now. For any further details that you may require, I request you to please log on to D-Link India website and you should get all the required information. Thank you very much.